plaintiff, Barbara Pete, was friends with the defendants. But after they moved in with her, she discovered they were slobs. Barbara claims the defendants fought constantly and even tried to attack her. She's suing them for rent, an electric bill, and harassment. Defendants Desiree Shea Ross and her boyfriend Christopher Master insist Barbara is the one who assaulted Desiree, so Christopher stepped in to protect her. They're countersuing for harassment and pain and suffering. All rise. This court is now in session. The Honorable Judge Greg Mathis presiding. You may now be seated. Start with you. Um, so I met Shay Ross 2009 when we lived in the same apartment complex. We were best friends for nine years. I met Christopher in 2017 when I worked at Walmart. I was his carpool. Um, we decided to get an apartment together, all three of us, and we moved in in September. And he brought along his sister. Aside from that, Your Honor, they were terrible to live with. I was assaulted by Shay when she was seven months pregnant, where she shoved me and That's also put her hands on. What was so bad about living with yeah. him? Um, well, they weren't That's very awful. clean, Your Honor. They, they what? Um, they weren't very they were clean. nasty. They were filthy. Okay. Um, they always ran. They always ran up the let AC. Finish, I'll let you respond in a minute. <laughs> Hmm. They bickered and fought a lot, and they were very combative with me when I would ask them, can you guys, you know, just keep the house clean? It's three adults here all day. That was a problem amongst them, so I eventually just gave up on that. I you um, had to live in a nasty house, too? Absolutely. I lived in their filth, outside of my okay. room. Okay. Yeah. Go ahead. I work, like, around the corner from where his mother lives. She comes into my store, and I pull her to the side and ask her, you know, have you talked to your son and them about the um, money situation and the living situation. She said, no, I don't speak to them like that and I don't see them. Yeah, hey, I'm just hearing about the money situation. What do you mean, money situation? Money situation? Um, well, I had to cover portions of their rent and an outstanding electricity bill that has gone under. What was the agreement on rent? Um, we were to pay, um, <clears throat> it was four ways that we would split the rent, but at the time, Shay was the only person who could cover mm -hmm. their three ends. But I also wanted to continue to let you know that um, when I was talking to his mother who invited me over to finish the conversation, mm -hmm. she, it was pretty much, they had set me up because I ended up getting jumped <sighs> That's by, not your honor. I That's ended up getting John? jumped by Shay, <laughs> his mother, and the, um, and her boyfriend. About what? About the money, because when I asked Shay, why do I have to sue you after nine years of friendship, mm -hmm. she hopped out the car aggressively, you, swinging Honor. her arms, telling me, sue me, my N-word, you're not ever going to get your money, sweetie. And That's in the process of her doing all that, she's aggressive. She's put her hands on me before. So I, like, jumped to the defense, and that's when... You called the, the police? I call, No, I didn't call the police there because the boyfriend, the mother's boyfriend, brought out a knife, so we left. All so right, let left. me hear from them. All right, Your Honor. Um, yes, we borrowed money from her. Uh, she paid a portion of our rent. But at the end, she's saying that we owe her different amounts. She's coming to family members saying that we owe her six. You keep a nasty house. <laughs> but <laughs> now we we have Are you two kids. No, nah, we have two kids, and it's uh, all four of us in one room, and we're not the only ones that's in the house. My sister was standing in the living room. Uh, she's saying that your sister was standing. Yeah, my sister was standing in the living room. So you all had five mm -hmm. as a family, mm -hmm. okay? And it was only one of her. Mm -hmm. And the rent was only split three ways. It was split. Four it was ways. split four ways. So as of that, we were, pay we were paying like 321 from each person. Mm -hmm. So when that came about, uh, when it started as what she was trying to say that my girl had harassed her at seven months pregnant, that was not true. I no, never right? put my That's hands on Barbara she called, Pete. She okay. called. I have put my hands on her friend, but I never no, put my hands on Barbara No, you shoved me. So okay. what happened that has was, never happened. What happened was, yes, it did. I have what happened was, I have the text was message. not at home. Mm -hmm. We had went and we had a hotel room. She sent her a text through Snapchat talking about her slippers. So when that came, she you were in a hotel that she couldn't afford. She called my I phone. Can't. You couldn't even pay rent, but and you were in she, a hotel. When she called my phone, she's threatening on throwing our things out, saying she was going to throw my things out and everything, knowing I'm on the lease. So I came home. They, her and her friend jumped in Dejanay, which jumped in her face. I told her, I said you put That's her, I said you put your hands on her, then it's gonna be a problem. She's oh. pregnant, so I'm being protective. That's no, not true. So yeah. she has my daughter. So what happened was Dejanay stepped up. She shoved Dejanay. Later on that night, we, me and Barbara went outside and we had a conversation. And then on that conversation behalf, she was saying, oh, I thought we was friends. Boom, that ended the night. 
Then upon that, she's coming to people saying that we owe her 1600 Then it jumps from sixteen to eleven twenty. Then jumps from there. Then she say, I owe her 500 And I also have proof here, and she also posts everything that she's doing. And then it comes upon to what my do you mother. Have? Oh. When it comes to what? And it also comes upon to my mother when the assault happens. This is your counterclaim, the assault. Yes. Mm -hmm. What I was told was she and his mother did have a conversation and that um, they were supposed to talk about whatever whatever happened to the money situation, mm -hmm. whatever the case may be. It was not a setup. His mom did not know I was coming to drop the baby off for if she could see her granddaughter. Nobody set no one up. No one had any weapons. Oh. That's when she comes up to my car yelling, oh, well, this is um, nine years of friendship. I want it all back. And how you gonna dog me out of $1,600? So as she comes up to my car, she's yelling in my face this night. And I told her, yeah, take me to court. Take me to court because now you're posting all this on Facebook, calling me all types of, you know, words that I don't want to say, but it's a lot that she has posted. She has harassed my mother. She has harassed me. She has harassed my, put my grandmother in it. She put my children How? in it. She, um, has there's... harassed your mother and grandmother? Oh. There's text messages. She told my, um... To them, directly to them? Yes, directly to them. Saying um, what? Give me some examples. She texts my mother saying, your child and her baby daddy once owed me $1,600 and refused to pay me. I'm watching them spend money on Instagram. Once again, not paying the person who's paid the rent. I have a $1,236 electricity bill racked up from your daughter um, and her family who lived in an apartment who couldn't afford nor keep it up. Doesn't matter which way you put it. Did your mother speak to you about it? I'm sorry, what? Did your mother speak to you about it? About the text messages? Yes, ma'am. Yes. What did you tell her? I told her just to just don't even respond. Why? Because I don't have, I don't want it to be something bigger than what it is. Let's move on. Your mother would have to sue her for the harassment okay. anyhow. Yeah. Now, tell me something she did to you all. And to us all, uh, she also, she came, my mom ran into her. My mom had a conversation with her. And then, as what my mama had called me. Sir, um, what does she say or do directly to you? Not you all's mamas. Have your mamas come in and sue her. I want to know what she did to you all. She insulted None of this would have happened if you all, if we hadn't had child. this issue. Pardon me? She insulted she, me in front of my child. What did she do? She came up the time where she came up to the car harassing me about mm -hmm. the whole money and whatever. Uh -huh. She came up trying to swing on me. His mom had to hold her back, so her boyfriend or whoever the dude is took off on his mother's boyfriend at the same time, so it was kind of two altercations happening at the same okay, time. Okay, so she assaulted you. She swung at you. Yes. Like, why did it take swung... so long to get that out? That's what... Because I is was... Is that true? Jumping. No, you're right. She says so not true, and I'm inclined she... to not believe it either. You took all that time talking about what she did to your mother on the Excuse... text, what she did to my mama on the text, and hit a woman and swung on you, right. and you ain't say a word. Right. All right. The What's the rent, ma'am? Let's just get right to the okay, rent. So all this nonsense is over. That's it. Nobody's getting a dime for any of this harassment nonsense. Okay. Let's get to the money. Rent. The money. Okay, so after they made a few payments, they still owe me six hundred and fifty for rent. And for what they, month? So August was two forty and September was eight hundred and eighty five. August they failed to pay two forty. Yes. September they, they failed to pay how much? Eight hundred and eighty five. And they were supposed to pay in August how much? They were supposed to pay 885 in August. That's what they actually Okay, so that covered. means they did pay some five or six hundred. Yes, sir. All right. 240 in August, 885 September. Is the, are those the only rent uh, yes. delinquencies? Yes, yeah, those are the All right. Tell me about the utility. The so electric the electricity bill. bill? Mm hmm The electricity bill had went up to um, $1,236. Mm -hmm. And it actually dropped to 11.03, so that split four ways. They covered three portions of that. Okay, so what, Darn. how much, e be quiet. So the three, so what they owe for the electricity bill is All y'all want to talk about is your mamas when I get to you. <laughs> okay, so yeah, I'm trying to get for to the what fact. they owe me for the electricity is actually $827. August, is that the month they missed for electricity? May, June, July, August, September and October. And that was to be split four ways, the bill? Yes, Your Honor. Do you have the bill? Um, 
Yes, it's right here. Thank you. All right, let me hear from you all regarding the rent. Um, upon that, I have paid her nine hundred and seventy-eight dollars. So honestly, to what? the truth, I'll, for a total of for what because, period of time? That's a liar, upon, upon honestly. Be quiet, please. Upon, upon I owed her. What did you pay for August? Her? What did you pay in August? Let's just do it that. In way. August, uh -huh. honestly, I sent her what I can send her. I sent her forty dollars in August. Forty dollars in August. Then what about September? Her, then again, I sent her in uh, December fifth, one hundred and fifty. No, I didn't ask about December. Well, August. That's... You gave her forty dollars in August, right? Yes. September. How much did you give her in September? September. I didn't give her anything. Yet. Okay. Good enough. That's the. Those mm -hmm. are the months in question. That's what she said you hadn't paid. That's what she's suing you for. You've admitted to only paying forty dollars between August and September. <laughs> so, what? Oh. I was saying, I was saying throughout the conversation. No, no, we're talking. I'm not doing that, sir. I spoke to her in September. August. I don't care yeah. about a conversation. We're talking about what you paid versus what you owe. You said August, September. I paid forty dollars. She said August and September. You still owe her. So we have an agreement here. We're not gonna mess that agreement up. The agreement is that you only paid forty dollars and you still owe her. That's clear. Now, what'd you pay on the electric bill? The, now, what did you? No, mm -hmm. Now, for the electric bill, mm -hmm. there was never no agreement to pay the electric bill. She brought the electric bill up okay. this year after okay. everything. She was living off her on the electric. No, she never paid the electric bill. This way, she couldn't afford to pay it she, all by no, herself. Of course, was, she did. What happened was, you got five people living on her. But, but, Sir, but, have a good but, day. Your claim had... is dismissed for harassment. I'm granting but, her her judgment for non-payment <laughs> by your own admission. You only gave her forty dollars for two months. And you say you didn't even know you had to pay a light bill? And you got five oh, people living up on this woman? Goodbye. Have a good day. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. you got us some scumbags and nice try trying to tase me. Yeah, try to tase you because you harassed me. There's my no family. reason for you to tase me. I'm 5'8. I'm 5'8. Where the dudes at? Where, Where the, the dudes what at? What dudes at?